All right, kid, we love doing this. Let's talk about what's trending now. Oh, but it, gosh. It, 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 uh, what's that I'm thing always scared. Saturday Night Live, it's, uh, ooh-wee, what's up with, with that? that? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Here we go. According to the Topic and Trends Report, which we subscribe to, there's a Who growing doesn't? interest in milk baths, Gib. So before you go crazy, listen, the milk bath uh, where you add milk in liquid or powdered form to warm water <laughs> in your bathtub. Mil- <laughs> For some context and history, milk baths go back into the days of Cleopatra, who allegedly kept 700 lactating donkeys on hand to fill her bathtub every day. There must have been a great time to be alive. Uh, right? uh, Bring me the love donkeys! And now, who doesn't have 700 lactating donkeys? <laughs> Just in their backyard. I just cashed out my 401k. I was able to buy 600 lactating donkeys. It was enough. Imagine it, Cleopatra's HR department. <laughs> That's the thing about, about the monarchs is they don't need an HR department or a, or a PR department. They just, they just do whatever the heck they want. It's good for your complexion, apparently. Okay, so, so great. Now we have you know, Carnation instant breakfast meals that you can put in your, in your add, to the, add to the bath water and get all of the same benefits without having to keep 700 lactating equines uh, near you at all time so good good for good for cleopatra for the rest of us you know get some powdered milk at the grocery store and uh you go nuts with this i just came up with a great idea for next time your kids are over no because they like they'll all take a bath together right no is uh chocolate milk can you imagine them trying to figure Uh, out how to drink it here's the the thing you have to realize look uh if you're gonna do this to yourself or your kids yeah first of all you want to drink what you're bathing in second of all (laughs) if you don't rinse off afterwards you're gonna stink you're going to smell like spoiled milk. It's going to get in the little crevice of your elbow. It's going to get everywhere your skin touches. And you're gonna, it's going to smell like rotten milk. So rinse off after you're done with your little milk bath. <laughs> Lactating donkeys or not. <laughs> That's intelligence for your life.